one, zero. Hello, Life Vantage. Darren Jensen coming to you for take two uh, of our uh, of our continuation of our doctor series. We apologize for the last one. I, I think we were having some technical issues. We we're getting feedback saying that you couldn't hear me. So uh, we just started a new broadcast. Well, anyway, as I mentioned before, this is the continuation of our doctor series. And we have uh, Dr. Brett Brimhall. He's a doctor of chiropractic. He also has a, a bachelor's in anatomy. And he is a, he's also certified in acupuncture and nutritional counseling. Uh, he, he has a fascination with the brain and how it works. He's completed over 300 extra hours in functional neuro neurology, and he studied neurofeedback, hip hypnosis, and biofeedback training. So we're grateful to have him join us. And uh, Brett, I want to welcome you on the call today. Thank you for being with Thank us. Thank you. Thank you. Be fun. <laughs> Yeah, it's, we're glad to have you uh, on with us today. Well, we'll jump right into it since we're starting a little bit late. Uh, so here was my, here's a, what I want to start out with. So when I came into the company a couple of years ago, uh, I didn't quite know how to fit Axio into my regimen daily. You know, should I use it for energy? Should I use it for focus? Um and now that I've been using it, I, I mean, it's, it's, it's helped in actually both of those areas. But when you talk to your colleagues, uh, some medical colleagues, or even as you're presenting the product to others, what do you say about Axio when you say, well, why Axio? How would you respond to that? Yeah, that's a great question. I, my introduction with uh, Axio was kind of similar to yours. Like, I'm like, how do you fit this in? But when I saw this little boy's life change in front of my eyes, I worked with him hard for a year and all of a sudden like things just started connecting. I was like, what is this and how does it work? Um, and so the way I look at Axio is I really think everybody would benefit. Okay. So who, who would you know that wouldn't want to get more done in a day? Who do you know that wouldn't want to be able to stay on task better? Um, we think of like our kids or any of us like in school or at work, we want, we do anything we could here we have something that I truly think allows the brain to connect the best way possible so you're able to get the most benefit from all the interactions that your brain has so it's able to connect the dots much more rapidly and much more completely and the effects are you know cumulative as well. So when I'm talking to uh, a mom or a dad um, for themselves or for other or someone that's an athlete, I say, look, we now know in sports or in school the difference between – Winning and losing the Olympics is like a tenth of a second, right? Or a tenth of a tenth of a second. So if your brain can connect that much quicker, that much faster, you're going to be able to get more done faster, more completely, and better. And so Axio is truly going to allow you to be able to allow your brain to work in, work at its peak. So no matter who it is, I think would benefit. Now, obviously, those that struggle a bit. The activity of what you feel when you're taking it, it's the effects that happen cumulative with it. Okay, so yeah, so why does Axio work the way that it does? You know, I think that's a good question. I'm not sure even when it was developed that they knew everything it would do. Um, one thing I asked from the people that I know, and I kind of sent a text, I said, hey guys, what would life be like without Axio? Um, like, what have you seen with it? And now we know we're not treating or curing things, but the responses I got back were amazing. Um, I think it works like it does because when you look at the combination of nutrients, it's the same concept that, that we have in all the products at LifeVantage. It's that synergistic blend is where the magic happens. So you look at the different ingredients, whether we're talking quercetin or New Zealand pine bark or L-theanine, each of those have different effects. But when you combine them, you get this specifically designed to affect the nervous system, which the nervous system system control and coordinates everything. I think that in itself, I think the combination that they did looking at how do we create focus. So the question that was asked at the beginning of the, of the action was like, how do we get a mental raise or increase in focus, concentration, increase in energy sustained without a crash? So when you combine those nutrients, like L-theanine, we know is great for focus, but it's really good for appetite, like control, right? So it's more of a calming agent where you have like quercetin that's really more of an antioxidant 
that kind of quenches through the radical, then you have some of the nerve two activation in it. So that actually allows the body to repair like the oxidative stress inside the brain, which could be anything that would damage neurons to basically allow neurons to function better. So you combine those things, you get what they were looking for. Sustained focus, concentration, staying in the zone. And I don't know of anything else out there that has that um, in the market. And we know there's a huge need for it because people are buying stuff off the shelves at Circle K and everywhere else trying to create brain energy. Um, and I think why it's different is because when they started out, they're looking for a way to create that focus. And I think they started with this question. When people come in to me all the time, they're always one of the main thing is fatigue. I've come tired. Um, for 16 plus years, 20 years of teaching, we always looked at fatigue differently. We looked at fatigue from a body perspective or a gland perspective. Uh, my eyes were opened when I saw this little boy's life in front of my eyes change, where we realized we're dealing with brain fatigue. But that's really with most of us. Like, why does the body not perform when somebody's doing, an, uh, you know, whether they're doing sport performance or academic performance, right? We know that point when people give up, right? The body didn't give up. The brain did. And so Axio corrects that brain fatigue. So whatever the person is doing, whether they're an engineer, a mom, a dad, an athlete, now that brain's higher as it should, coordinate and control the activities better than it has. Right, so that's why acting is so different. It's different because it wasn't asking how do we just create energy. It's like how do we address brain fatigue. So that's why I think it's different. That's like kind of a long answer, but like it, there's a lot more to axial than I think we realize. Um, and I think that that if somebody wanted to be better at whatever they did, they should drink axial. Right, if they wanted to be a better mom, dad, or just better at work. Like my little boy, he's ten. Like I come home and he says, "Buddy's right, Grant, hit me with an axial." I'm like, "What?" hit you with an axial, right? But what did they used to drink before, right? Not in my house, but other house. They're drinking Gatorade or all these other things, which is basically, it's, you know, it's basically sugar, water with a food coloring. And that's what we call it. That's what we call a rehydration, right? So we have actual, it truly addresses brain fatigue that kids like or people like, and it, it, it actually gets their brain focused better. So who wouldn't want their neighbor drinking axial just because they'd be a better neighbor? Or well, a coworker, let me, or whatever. Let me pose a question to you as I've, I've as I'm reading the comments that are scrolling by. One of them leads to a question that I would say, you know, who who would benefit from Axio? Uh, kids, adults, athletes, moms, dads. You've named quite a few of those categories. One specific question asked about, well, what about uh, kids? Uh, can kids take it? And what, what, well, what's your recommendation? What, you know, it's a, it's a great question. I get this all the time because people will read labels on bottles and says, well, you know, if you're not, it says did not take this if you're not 18. Well, that's a disclaimer we put. So if you look at what Axial is, is in it, right, and you walk down the grocery store and you watch what people put in their grocery carts, there's not labels that say, hey, kids shouldn't drink soda pop, right? Kids shouldn't eat candy bars, right? But would you rather have a brain drink once it's got solid research, solid nutrients, that affects your brain focus, right? So I think everybody would benefit, but I think that we get caught up too much on is if it's is it labeled for kids. There's not a lot of research on even baby formulas, right? That's why, but there's a liability that's there. So with kids in Axio, um, had the lady or individual that exposed me to Life Vantage, which was through her son, with the Axio, right? Had she not given her son Axio, he would still be struggling in school and behavior that that I couldn't work fix in a year of working with him every week. Had I not had that happen in my life, I wouldn't have been able to know how to help and give these other kids that I got texts from all day today about kids that you know have struggled with reading, have struggled with learning, have struggled in athletics that have basically you know were getting C's and D's. A good friend of mine. Um, chiropractor friend done tons of work with her his daughters struggled really bad in school CD student um, with the protanum and axio she went from a CD student to AB student um, is now serving church mission which things that she didn't think she'd do and this is after everything that him and I have studied and learned and him 25 years I mean 20 years so this axio is going to allow people to do and have their brain work in ways that it has not and so the short answer is anybody you would want their brain to work better should drink Axio. Is there anybody that shouldn't? I really can't think of anybody. 
like I spent two years in Georgia and people would feed their, give their kids sweet tea in their bottle, I think it'd probably be safer to give them Axial. Well, it, and and with that, I, I think from a company standpoint, we we follow specific guidelines or general recommendations. And I think kind of what you're saying, the standard is that we put on there that that it's recommended for 18 and above. Right. I, parents should use their best, you know, their best judgment if they wanted to deviate from that. Um, I know, at my, you know, personally, I know at my house, that's all my kids asked for. And I have five kids and I knew it was a hit when the kids started to use it. And then they started to ask for it constantly. Mm-hmm. And now they're raiding the cabinets, always looking for more Axio. And it's uh, they seem to like it. So to me, it's 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 very popular at the house. But again, use, you know, use your best judgment. Yeah. And, uh, I think we have it listed specifically for adults. Yeah, and, I, I pre- and I wanted to kind of prove that point. So those disclaimers are supposed to be that I'm glad they're there because yeah. we need to protect what we have. Right. Um, and so disclaimer are designed to be there because really there's no one that's going to volunteer their kid for a study. Right. As far as, you know, we can't really study those. But look at the ingredients and, and use your judgment as a parent. Um, but I'm glad the disclaimers are there. and I'm glad that the company keeps us safe by saying, look, this is this is what we know. But then use your judgment as a parent um, of what you actually give your kids. Um, and so from my standpoint, in my own family, like all my kids drink it. Um, because of what I've seen it do in others and because of the way in which I know it works. Okay. Well, let's say regardless if, if, if I drink Axio, what are some of the benefits that you would normally expect to see, you know, without making medical claims, yeah. you know, what would we, what would you generally expect to see as a, as a benefit? You know, one of the things I love about Axio is that brain fatigue can be very, easily felt and experienced in all of us. And it sometimes feels like in some people, overwhelm or lack of focus, lack of motivation, um, no drive. Like those are all things that we experience with brain fatigue, right? Now, so if you think about that, then who wouldn't benefit, right? So you take an athlete, they'll do everything they can to gain that much more edge. Well, what I typically see happening, I remember I was sitting across this room from this one lady and she had what she called pregnancy brain, right? For three years or four years, right? She drank the Axio and that, that feeling of what she called pregnancy brain lifted first time in three years, right? So the effects sometimes are pretty quick because if the brain works, it just feels better, right? It's, it can be that quick, but the effects are cumulative, right? So what I've noticed with um, let's just take you know different kids or other adults that I've seen a lot of who we think we are is based on how our brain works so you take somebody that doesn't feel like they're smart right because their brain's just not working as well as it could because they don't have actually or they don't have protandum right they haven't they're not living out their full genetic potential so imagine what happens when these individuals their brain starts clicking right they start remembering things they start retaining them they start recalling them they start doing well in school what happens to their self-esteem? Okay. What type of friends do they choose? What type of careers do they choose? Um, there's a small town in Northern Arizona. I go up to with the team that's going up there. Phenomenal group. And I've heard story after story. One in particular, this girl that some very serious struggles in her life. Um, they called her the cave dweller because some things that have happened in her life. She just kind of isolated herself from some stress that had happened in the families. And, after the axiom and protanum, there's a little girl that went, went got her grade up to 3.0, got into do, filling out her college applications, now moved out of the house, um, is now at a, at a junior co- a, a college starting school here in a couple weeks. Um, this is a little girl. Not only that is awesome in of itself where she's moving forward in life. You think about people that aren't, right? But she's not moving forward in life. But here's a little girl that in the first time for years, since she was, I think, 10, hugged her mom. Okay, because her brain's working differently where she's able to see the world differently. And so that's the difference with when the brain's working. The brain is working differently. We see ourselves differently. We see our world differently. Um, and so when action was made, I don't think that that is what they expected to happen, but that's what's happened. So I think it's well underutilized. People are looking for a brain solution. And never in time in life have we been a – we're probably the least active we've ever been on this planet as far as physically – yet our brains are probably the most active. So what's fatiguing most of the time is not people's bodies, it's their brain. And Axial is the answer for that. Now, uh, Dr. Brimhall, you had mentioned that 
there are some cumulative effects of using the product. What can you share with us on, on that side? You know, uh, so to me, the cumulative effects are this, like, you think about school, we start with like basic math, one plus one is two, to eventually you go to algebra, calculus, whatever else, right? And they build on each other. So the brain is no different. The brain is always learning, right? Um, so with Axio, so if your brain is firing like it's supposed to, you're going to re remember, retain, recall, and then integrate that information. And so what I've noticed with Axio and also the effects of, of NERF2, right, and ProTandem is if you can get the brain to work better today, it's going to learn today what it needs to learn today, and then it can apply it to tomorrow and the next day and the next day and the next day. Very similar to NERF2 activation. If you can take NERF2 activation and you can activate with the most potent NERF2 activator like ProTandem and you can reduce oxidative stress roughly 40% in 30 days, the body will fix what it has to first, okay, what it wants to second. And that's why people say, well, I didn't feel anything. Well, your body's doing things with it anyway. It just may not feel it, right? But we don't feel illness until it's there. And illness is a process, right? So with, with what I've seen with um, Axial specifically is people will sometimes feel things, right? They start feeling better, but then they start learning, and then they start retaining, and then they start recalling. And so you'll see people in jobs, right, being able to and what I've noticed is with brain, it's very fascinating. If you've ridden a bike before and you haven't ridden for several years, you can kind of pick it up again, right? Well, with Axio, the pathways you develop by having the brain connect in ways it is, it gets better and better with time. Whereas with medication, we know when we lose that medication, the benefits actually a lot of times are gone, right? And so you have to a lot of times increase those doses of medications, right, to get that same chemical effect, whereas Axio, because the brain is learning, it keeps that effect. Now, would I ever want to be without it? I wouldn't, because I want my brain to be at its peak every day. Did that help? Yeah, it did. Thank you. So, um, now, if, a few questions that I have is, all right, I know the benefits of it. I've, I've felt the benefits uh, personally, and I've seen it in, in my own family. What do you recommend? I mean, how do you recommend that we use it? How often, how much can I take too much of it? You know, okay, great, great question. So, um, so if you look, look at the, the ingredients of Axio, right? All very, very, very safe. The only thing that we, I would say you got to watch for, and Dr. Fief and I've talked about a little this is that, we know in the caffeinated actually there's 100, roughly 100 milligrams of caffeine, all right? So once you get past 400 milligrams of caffeine, that's where we might be having, having some abnormal back effect, whether it's high blood pressure or stuff like that. Now, I think it'd have to be even higher than that uh, because with Axio, you have the you have a lot of other um, calming nutrients with it. But I would say how often? Every day. And we say, you know, frequently and often. So general rule, you very easily do a, a – a caffeinated one in the morning and a decaf one in the afternoon for sure. Um, I think if you go under, over 400 milligrams of caffeine, that's what we do know from research that so we have to watch that. So that'd be like four caffeinated ones. I, I know with me, for some reason, I've always been a little sensitive to caffeine. I, I generally don't drink much caffeine at all. Uh, and the decaf one is really good for me. I, I really feel, I, I feel energy from it. I feel uh, the mental focus. What, what's the, you know, in your opinion, what's the big difference? Uh, do you see a big difference between the caffeinated and non-caffeinated one? You know, when I first came out and I saw the results I did with some people, um, I started playing with it because I hadn't drink caffeine probably, I had drink one caffeinated beverage probably every two years before this. Like I just didn't drink it very often. So I wanted to play with it. So I would, I would take the caffeinated and I did it late at night just to see if it'd keep me up. It doesn't, right? So it's the combination of those things in it that have the brain focus but doesn't hype it up. Right. So um, very, very safe to take morning or night. But at the general rule, I think caffeinated one in the morning, non-caffeinated in the afternoon. Um, and it's truly the difference between the caffeinated and non-caffeinated. There's what's called DMAE in the caffeinated one. And that's really the only big difference between the two. All right. And they've done that for a couple of reasons. Um, one is because DMAE you can get in some countries, other countries you cannot. And because we're a global company, right, you want to be able to have that energy drink to go across the global market. But at the same time, um, I like that it's different, too, that they're the caffeinated and non-caffeinated because maybe you have somebody that is sensitive to caffeine or that just they don't want to drink caffeine. It's nice to have an option for both. Um, what I have noticed, and this is very rare, 
but a lot of people are super anxious. Like they just get nervous or whatever else. And sometimes when they drink the non-caffeinated Axio and they're super hyped up anxious people, they might feel relaxed. And if they're relaxed and they haven't slept well, they'll feel tired and they think it's the Axio. No, your brain's finally relaxed and says, yeah, you can sleep, right? So there's a difference between being what I call tired and relaxed. And so Axio, especially the non-caffeinated, has that effect on calming down that brain overwhelm and that, that anxious feeling that people get and it calms them down. Now, you talked about uh, nerf activation in the brain, nerf 2 activation in the brain. As, uh, and so if I'm looking at the regimen of product, yeah. what, what would you recommend that, uh, you know, the products that I'm using along with, with Axio? Yeah, so, and I, people ask me that question quite often. Um, and it's kind of funny because I've sold dietary supplements for years in my practice. And it's uh, kind of interesting how much um, I utilize these products over my others now. So across the board, I really wish just to make this world a better person, but better place, right? If everybody would be do the Nerf two, right? So we're reducing oxidative stress forty percent in thirty days. So think about healing forty percent faster. You do NRF one, right, which allows the mitochondria to function at their peak, right? Which we need the powerhouse of the cells. Every cell when it can't have energy, either dies or changes, right? So we need that mitochondria working. The ProBio is an absolute foundation. Um, there's tons of gut-brain connections. Okay, and if you don't have a good digestive tract, you're not assimilating when you're eating or breaking it down. And a lot of the chronic diseases that we see nowadays start in the digestive tract. Okay, and then the axial. So to back up, NERF1, NERF2, ProBio, which we know those are active essentials, which I think is brilliant that they put those together and they made a no shipping. I love that. Such a foundation. Okay, and the axial. Those would be my top four. Now, there'd be silly not to use a nerve activation for the skin. If you want to like look younger and protect your skin. Um, and it'd be silly not to use the cleanse and the other things that we have available to us as well. But my kids and I, so I have four kids. So nerf one, nerf two, pro bio, axial every day. Okay. My oldest is the only one. He won't swallow pills very well. So he has, it, it's, he's required to drink an axial every day and he's learning how to, you know, take the other ones. But every one of my family members take those every day. Um, not because, we have a condition. I really don't care if I never know what I didn't get, right? So we know Washington State says NRF2 activation has been called the most extraordinary therapeutic and preventative breakthrough in the history of medicine. So I love that extraordinary, right? Said it twice, but it says therapeutic and preventative. That's fascinating to me. We're talking about something that they're gonna figure out if they can activate NRF2, it can become a therapy and also prevention, right? So for me, I'm on the side of prevention. Right? I want to prevent because I don't care what I know I don't get. But at the same time, isn't it nice to know if we can activate the cellular ability to repair, activate the genes, so nutrigenomics or biohacking as we call it, that we can allow the body to perform not only at its best today, but for as long as possible. It was, uh, thank you for that explanation. You know, interesting, you were talking about, you know, you named off your top ones internally, but it also mentioned our true science. So you can uh, put it on your skin. Just kind of a side story. My son uh, is on summer break from college and he decided to go get a metal, medical assisting degree. And so he's doing his, what do you call it? Uh, where you go in and do your, uh, where you have to do a certain number of hours in a clinic. Yeah. Internship. So a 90 year old woman came into the clinic and this was just uh, yesterday. And he was talking to her and he said, Hey, I just have to say, your skin looks absolutely great for being 90 years old. And what is your secret? And the lady said, well, let me tell you, I use this product called True Science for my advantage. <laughs> and this is what my face looks like. Have you ever heard about it? My son's like, yeah, I have heard about that company. <laughs> <laughs> but it, he, it, he came and visited me and, and told me that story. And I thought, wow, that was uh, pretty incredible. And I didn't realize just how broad broadly this is spreading i i just yeah. had my 30th high school reunion on friday believe it or not 30 years and uh about 10 of the guys there you know would just in the conversation ask me so what do you do and i said well you know i i work at life vantage and they'd say you're kidding me i've been on pro tandem and i love it and so uh, that was about four out of the 10 told me that they're on pro tandem and i'm like wow this is incredible so 
it, great products. And, and Dr. Brimhall, thank you for taking the time today. I know that you have patients that are piling up and you need to go and, and get to them, but I do want to thank you for taking time out of your busy, busy schedule to share with us the benefits of Axio and some of your wisdom. I know that everyone really enjoyed it. Well, I appreciate it. Thanks for the opportunity. Uh, um, thank you again. All right. Hey, thanks, Dr. Brimhall. We'll see all you right. later. Yeah, bye. bye.